Right, in this video we're going to try and differentiate f of x as 1 over x from first principles. So remember what we're trying to do when we're finding f, differentiating uh, f of x, we're finding what's known as the gradient function, a formula for the gradient. You must always keep that in the back of your mind when you're doing this sort of thing. So we've got f of x is equal to 1 over x. f dashed of x uh, from first principles is the limit of h goes to 0 of f of x plus h minus f of x over h. So, if f of x is 1 over x, then f of x plus h will become 1 over x plus h, using our function notation, minus f of x, which is 1 over x, all over h. Now, normally to subtract fractions, you need a common denominator, so we'll make a common denominator of x brackets x plus h so and then here we've multiplied this by x we must multiply this one by x and then here this x we multiply by x plus h so we're going to have minus brackets x plus h don't forget the brackets here and here because it's minus all of it all over h now removing the bracket in the top here we're going to have the limit as h goes to zero of x minus x and then minus times a plus gives me minus h over x squared, running this bracket, plus hx, all over h. Now, x minus x, well, they will cancel each other out. So we've just got minus h here. So we're going to have the limit as h goes to 0 of minus h over x squared plus 8x. Now, dividing by h is the same as multiplying by 1 over h. When being your rules of uh, division of uh, fractions, and therefore this h and this h will then cancel out. But remember, we still have the minus sign at the top here, so we have the limit of minus 1 over x squared plus hx. Now, h is very, 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 very small, so this term here we can ignore because it's going to be extremely small, and therefore we're just left with minus 1 over x squared as the gradient function for 1 over x, or the differential of 1 over x is minus 1 over x squared. Okay, this has been a video to show you how to differentiate the reciprocal function, function 1 over x, from first principles. I hope you've understood, and I thank you very much for watching.